So Pisces, you know, what can I say? You know, this person clearly wants you. It's obvious and, you know, there's you can't deny that there's certain feelings that are um, making you feel a certain type of way when it comes to this. But there is something that's stopping this from progressing. So let's start the reading and I'm explaining to you exactly what's going on. Hello Pisces, welcome to my channel, welcome back to uh, my channel for some of you guys, hope you guys are doing well. This is your general love reading for uh, August, going to take a look and see who's showing up in your reading, see what they're thinking and feeling regarding yourself and of course vice versa as well. Feel free to jump ahead to the start of the reading guys, it is timestamp. This section is really for those that just kind of prefer to see me shuffle on camera. Okay, as I always say, please take what resonates and just leave what doesn't. And if this isn't your story, if I don't pick up on your story, stick around as there could be just messages throughout that jump out and speak to you. And of course, you know, just use this as a guide to support you and move you in the direction of where you're wanting to go. Because ultimately we, we create our own reality. So just give me a moment to just lay these cards. Oops, let me move that. Okay, so give me a moment to just take these in and I'll be back. Start your reading. And of course, for those of you who don't know, the center card represents the current state of the connection. You've got the two main cards up here, how you're both showing up behind the scenes, what you're both thinking and feeling regarding each other. And of course, we both move to next. Take whatever side resonates with you guys, picking up as this being your side. Personally, you're dealing with over here, but you can always flip switch whatever side just kind of resonates the most. All right, so Pisces, I'm going to start by saying that, you know, and I feel like this is what sparked this kind of connection or this connection to kind of move in a certain direction. There's support here. I'm not sure whether it's coming from, you know, one side. I feel like it's an equal give and take of this very much um, in some area, of course, anyway, a supportive, understanding type of vibe this there's some area or in some way that you both display that this connection definitely because it's highlighted that's why um you know they're showing up as being very much emotionally happy this is causing them to feel good it's not to say that it's not causing you to feel good i feel like of course there's acknowledgement on let me just press that there's acknowledgement on your end pisces as well that you know, this person makes you feel good. I feel like this connection for a lot of you might be unexpected or it might have crept up on you. Maybe it started off very much innocent, but it's evolved into some, I'm going to say some form of acknowledgement from both ends that you're kind of feeling a certain type of way because this person, and with that, this person wants more. It's like they want more. They want to move this to something more ultimately that's how they're kind of seeing you it's like okay you know I'm feeling a certain type of way you make me emotionally happy there's a certain vibe that we've created or that we've got between us and I want to pursue this I want this to go further but they are aware that there is some form of change huge transformation a, a death of some form and I feel like it's to do with you Pisces I feel like because you're showing up as, as the lovers particularly in this deck there is this other third party looking in on on you. So I feel like it's you, your end. You're coming from a place where maybe you're tied up with someone. Maybe you've, you know, maybe you're involved with someone already. Like I said, this could have started off as really innocent and it's evolved into something unexpected. You know, there is, I mean, I feel like this person gives you peace in some way. There's a peace element to this. It's like this person gives me peace, but you do have your boundaries up. You do have your boundaries up and that's simply because 
you know, what you're involved in or what's going on in terms of your life and someone else that you might be talking to or have been committed to or whatever the case may be. So you can't give much. You can't even, I would go so far as to say, Pisces, you can't feel much or you can't give yourself the room to feel or let your emotions kind of be, if that makes sense. But again, it's this, this person kind of gives me some peace or there's an element of, maybe that peace is coming from this supportive energy. Maybe this person is something around that peace um where like i said this person is very much looking to to um move this into something further and for some reason i'm not sure why this might resonate with with some of you or a lot of you that there's they, they kind of feel like they deserve this or there's some form of justice in this i deserve this it it's deserved in some way but i tell you something this person is keeping I don't think they've expressed what it is that they really want, Pisces. I don't feel like this person has expressed what they really want with you because there's an element of them holding back, holding back their feelings, holding back their emotions. And in a way, because of that, it's kind of eating them up. It's causing them to feel very much trapped, like bursting. Yeah. <laughs> like I said, I'm sure... For a lot of you, this has been an, or this was an, an, an unexpected type of connection. Uh, but they're wanting things to turn around. They're wanting things to go in their favour. Wanting things to go in their favour. I just wanted to, yeah, but very much aware that there's going to be a change or there would need to be some form of huge transformation, a depth of some form. I feel like it's very much tied to them being aware of your circumstance or what's going on for you. Yeah. If 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 some of you are starting to feel guilty about this connection, I mean, you know, I would go so far as to say, and I've said this throughout this. I do apologize for recovering from a cold, guys. Um, throughout this reading so far, is that it was unexpected for a lot of you. Didn't expect it to develop into this, or for you to feel this, or for you to, you know. So. I wouldn't say, and I don't feel like you've acted on anything. There is this queen of swords. So you've, you've got your guards up or you've, you're putting your boundaries up. So I don't feel like you're, you're, you've acted on these advances if there's been any advances. I don't feel like, like I said, I feel like this person has been holding back. So there's no reason for you to feel guilty if that's coming up for you. Um, of course, some of you might have. <laughs> acted on, on, on certain things that you might feel uncomfortable with. But I feel like for the majority of you, you've not gone, you've not crossed the, 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 the lines, so to speak. But you move into a place where you start to feel like, you know, you've got that seven of wands. And that's you blocking their advances. It's them, and it makes sense because they move into the devil energy which we'll get into in a minute but it's you blocking their advances you, you block in what you feel might get you in trouble or what you feel might lead you down a path that you you might not be ready to go down or you might feel like you're compromising something else based on whatever the case may be but so you go into this you know I don't want to use the word defensive because it's not so much defensive it's just you combating their advances that makes sense <laughs> because they then move, they move into this and that's stemming from this obsessive um and that makes sense then which is that seven that makes sense if they, they they move into this mindset if they act on that as well if they act on that if they are um driven by that those types of thoughts and feelings that they are clearly starting to have and i feel like like i said it's stemming from the fact that they're not able to for some reason and could be as well not able to be honest or express what they're really feeling or what they're really wanting at this stage and it makes sense like I said going back to your situation but we'll see how this plays out in part two of the reading which should be showing up on the screen as we speak guys so click on that um if not you can always click on the love and singles playlist that way you can indulge in more readings for the month Pisces see you guys in a bit <laughs> 